Hello everybody, so in today's video I'm gonna show you how to download and install Alex Mobs for Minecraft Java in 2025. So let's get started. The first thing you wanna do is go to your web browser and I will have links in the description if you're interested but just go to your search bar and search up a website called ModWint, like so. Once you enter, you should see ModWint.com, just click on ModWint and you should be on the modern home page. Now, just go to the top of the website to discover content and then go to mods. Then, just go to search mods and type in Alex Mobs. Once you're done, you should see Alex Mobs here. Just click on the name and this should bring you to the home page for Alex Mobs on Modwind. So now, just go to the versions tab and here you want to go to game versions and select what game version you want to play. I'll just select the latest one you have. And here we see that we can use Forge or NeoForge. We will just be using Forge in this case. So we just have to download using the green download button. And here, once we're done, all you want to do is simply go to the version's name. And if you scroll down, you should see that we have dependencies called Citadel. So you have to go ahead and click the Citadel dependency, which is required. And here you have to go to versions. And now all you have to do is game versions and select the same game versions as Alex Mobs, which is 1.20.1 in my case. And we just get the latest file. Now, once you're done, all you want to do is go to a new tab and get yourself Forge. And to get Forge, you have to go on Forge Minecraft, like so. And you should see files minecraftforge.net, just click the link. And this will bring you to the latest Forge version they have. So, as we don't want the latest, we want 1.20.1 in our case. Just use the drop down menus and you should see 1.20.1 if you choose that version. And here, you just have to click the installer. And you might have to wait a couple seconds. Here we can see on the top right corner, we have to wait 5 seconds around there. So once you wait this, you will see a skip button. Here it is. Just click skip. And this will download Forge, Citadel we had before, as well as Alex Mobs. That's what you want. But as this is a .java file, is if you don't have Java for Windows, you will have to go to a new tab and go to JDK23. You have to go on this website here specifically. And here, you have to do accept all, and I will have this website in the description. But basically, all you want to do here is just select JDK23, Windows if you're using Windows, and the x64 installer. You only need to do this if you can't actually run the Forge installer. Although, if you can, you can just now close your web browser. Now, you can open up your downloads folder, and you should see Forge here. So that's the first thing you want to do. You want to double click Forge, and this will open up a little Forge installer. Just do install client, that should be selected by default, and just do OK. And here, it is just installing Forge for us, so we just need to wait for that. Once you're done, you just want to do OK, and once it's closed, you can go to your Minecraft launcher. With the Minecraft launcher, we can add the Alex mods and Citadel mods to the mods folder. Now, here we see that we have Forge, so we are all good. But you have to go to installation see on the top of the launcher you have to select around forge and go to the folder icon here you should see that you have a mods folder and if you don't have one it's no big deal all you have to do is just right click new folder and then you can just name it mods but if you have a mods folder you can just double click it and it should be empty so you can go to your downloads folder you can select citadel and alex mobs and go to the copy button he can go back to the previous folder using the top left arrow and click paste. And you should have Alex and Citadel mods in the .minecraft mods folder. So here, all you have to do is go back to the Minecraft launcher, you have to go to play, make sure Forge is selected, and then just click play. Here you might have a little warning, just do understand the risks, and click play again. Once you're done, all you want to do is just go ahead and create a new world. You can go to single player, for example, and create a new world. Now, if you have a server which has Alex Mobs, you can join that server, of course. 
but if we create a new world we should have new mobs in the game. Okay, so number one, we spawn with a book called Animal Dictionary and if we go ahead and try to find new mobs, we can try and find new mobs or we can just try and spawn them in. So, let's try to find new mobs if there is any. I see new fishes, so here you can see that we have a flying fish I believe. Here we see... So that's just a llama, that's normal. Here we have something else. Some form of opossum, maybe? So yeah, there is, there is new mobs that are very scattered around the place, which is good because you don't want to have too many mobs everywhere. But here we can see we have another one. A raccoon. And if we actually check out the book, we can see all of the new mobs that we do have in the game as well. Here you can see kangaroos, so that's pretty cool. Now can we copy them? Yes, that's pretty, that's, that's amazing. So you can also just get spawn eggs, so if we get ourselves some spawn eggs, yep, there you go. We can get ourselves some custom spawn eggs as well. Oh, here we have a bunch of animals here. You see a rhino, that's awesome. So yeah. So that is how we get Alex mobs for Minecraft Java in 2025. So if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye!